All right, guys, welcome to Wellness Radio. I am your health expert, Dr. Nathan Warren. Uh, I'm super glad to be here this morning. I hope you guys are having a great Saturday so far. Uh, you know, I know that one thing that we've been really looking forward to for a long time is some stinking sunshine, man. Uh, you know, if somebody would have told me, you know, six years ago, uh, moving to Chattanooga, that it was going to rain more here than Seattle, Washington, uh, I probably would have never moved here had I known how much rain we get here. But uh, I'm super glad to have some sunshine today. So, uh, you know, it, it should lift everybody's mood. It's not it's amazing how much energy we get uh, you know from the Sun so if this is your first time tuning into wellness radio uh, super glad to have you here it's gonna be an amazing uh, amazing ride for you guys uh, on today's show you know I this whole purpose of the show is to bring you guys the real information on health um, because as you know in this current state in our society it's amazing how much information out there uh, is driven by fear it's driven by uh, you know un unfortunately fiction over fact uh, and so on this show we try to give you the information that you need we try to give you everything that you uh, you know to, to take your health to the next level and so on today's show it's gonna be a lot of fun you know I, I, I know one of the things that we like to go over on this show is how to uh, best mitigate stress how to adapt to stress and I have uh, an amazing expert here who is going to uh, you know really kind of dive in with me on the nervous system and some of the best ways to hack it uh, on the planet and and again this is a low Local business owner here in Chattanooga, it's going to be a lot of fun. It's going to be awesome. Uh, Lucidity uh, downtown, it's over near our stomping ground, which is super exciting. And we're going to dive into the nervous system and everything. Actually, the number one longevity hack, according to Harvard experts, uh, that came out about 11 months ago was to balance the nervous system. Uh, and we're going to go over one of the best ways to do that on the planet. It's super exciting. So uh, again, as you're tuning into this, today's show, if you have any questions, you can absolutely call into the radio. Uh, that number is 423-267-1023. Again, that's 267-1023. You can call in live, ask your questions, or you can join me on Facebook Live at Drs. Warren. That's D-R-S-W-A-R-R-E-N. Uh, and again, ask your questions there. Join us live. It's one of the funnest things that we can possibly do is actually go over, uh, you know, actually go over, uh, you know, questions and answer them as we go uh, and really, you know, be able to dive deep into uh, those questions. So again, Drs. Warren, or you can visit our website, drswarren.com. Uh, if you haven't checked us out over there, we've got all kinds of different blog posts. Um, and if you like and follow our page, it's going to be pretty exciting because tomorrow night we're going to be doing an entire uh, live on the coronavirus, right? Everybody's freaking out about the coronavirus. We're going to be going over some of the best ways uh, to mitigate your chances of getting the coronavirus. And if you get it, what to do. Uh, and again, kind of dispel some of this fear that's out there, um, you know, and, and, and really dive deep. So go ahead and like and follow our page at Doctors Warren on Facebook, uh, and you'll be getting those notifications pretty soon. All right. So that being said, uh, you know, again, as we're about to dive into this, you know, I, I want you guys to realize when it comes to the nervous system, uh, it's the most important system in the in, in the entire body. Literally, uh, everybody says, well, I think your immune system is more important. Well, you got to realize what controls your immune system. It's the nervous system. Uh, when we talk about, you know, your hormones, right? And we talk about your endocrine system, what controls it? It's your nervous system. Uh, when we talk about, you know, your, your skin, your your hair, your gut, everything is controlled by your nervous system. And so in order for us to express health, it's really in, in the general terms, the definition of health is how well do you adapt right to your internal and external environment based on how the nervous system responds. So that being said, uh, I have an amazing guest here, right? And I'll let you introduce uh, yourself so that, so that people can know uh, who you are, tell us about where you're from, and, and just kind of give us a general de like description of what you do. Hi, well, I'm Angela McAllister. I own Lucidity uh, Float and Wellness Center, which is, uh, like I said, downtown. Mm -hmm. uh, it's in the South Side area. And uh, we, everything we do specializes in helping people to relax. Oh man, and I know. To get that nervous system, like you're saying, yes. to just settle yes. down. Yes. It's, yes. you know, stress is a killer. It's, it really is. Yes. And so, 
Um, everything that we do at Lucidity helps people to just calm down and to relax. Yeah. And, um, so uh, we do offer um, massage and acupuncture, but uh, cool. you know, our main thing is, is our float tanks. And so um, floating is something that's been around since the 1950s. Yeah. Um, and uh, it's it's just now kind of um, you know getting a little bit more attention in the mainstream media yeah. because oh, uh, yeah. because uh, there's a lot of research that's coming out right now yeah. about how effective it is in treating things like anxiety, PTSD, no um, a, a wide variety of, of, of ailments, especially things like um, chronic pain with um, you know sore muscles and, and oh, yeah. back problems, fibromyalgia, fibromyalgia, mm -hmm. exactly. Yeah. There's, there really is a long list of things. Um, I personally started floating for my ADD just because I couldn't get the little monkey in my brain yeah, to come down. Yeah. And so it really does help with a lot of different things. Um, but essentially what it is is it's a space where um, all of your senses are, um, are are basically taken away. Mm -hmm. And so your your mind is not having to process any data. Yeah. And it's able to just calm down. Gotcha. And, that's and it's, basically it. it's really the, the only time besides last time you were in your mother's womb, right? right. That, that you had no, you know, no, really any yeah. sensory input. Exactly. Um, yeah, I mean, you know, it's amazing is I did it. So my first time floating was probably... Gosh, I don't know. Now it would have been what two and a half years ago or something yeah, like that. Exactly. And and when I when I did it, I'm not gonna lie. I I literally felt absolutely amazing afterwards. Yeah. And and I think it was. I can't remember if it was if it was you guys or something I read um, that said like about a ninety was a ninety minute session is equivalent to what almost eight to nine hours of like deep sleep. Right. Yeah. It's it's a. Uh, that's a, that's something that we say. I'm not sure like where they where that, where comes, that comes from. from to yeah, be yeah. Honest. But um, but yeah, that's truthfully how I feel. When yeah, I come oh, yeah. Out. It's yeah. very anecdotal. Um, and, uh, and 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 it also doesn't take away from sleep. So, right, right, right. So I tend to float late in the evenings. Yeah. Um, because I don't have anything else going on for yeah. the, rest of the day, and I'm, it's easier for me to um, like quiet my mind at that time. Oh yeah. And uh, and and then at the end of it, I always want to you know I sleep amazing. Oh, I bet. Yeah. I sleep like a little baby yeah. afterwards. Oh yeah. So. Well, and then the other thing that I think is absolutely Absolutely. Actually, probably one of my favorite things about doing the float tank is that you're literally laying in magnesium salts, right? right? right. So, like, was it like a thousand pounds of magnesium salts? Yeah, yeah. A and thousand so, pounds. yeah, it's, it's literally like we, when when, you, when we took the the salt and laid it in the you know bottom of the pool to like fill it all up. I thought we had made a horribly expensive mistake. <laughs> yeah. Because I thought there's no yeah. way on earth this that you is all needed that much. Yeah, yeah, like it's yeah. just crazy. It's yeah. it, you you literally the, the salt is literally above the water level. Yeah. And so um so you're just floating on this wet bed of salt. Yeah. And, but it supports your body completely. Oh yeah. So all of your muscles are able to relax. And it, it and because the water is the same temperature as your body, mm -hmm. um, you at some point you lose track of where your body ends and where the water begins. Yeah. So it makes um, you know your like I said your your mind just kind of drifts off. You sort of disconnect from your body in a sense. Oh yeah. And you're not able you're not having to to process any input. Yeah. And so your mind just it just almost forces your your brain to relax. Oh yeah. yeah. And I, I remember too being I mean I was probably a good thirty minutes in you know and mm -hmm. and as you're going through like you can physically feel different parts of the body relax right but I, right. I remember being like 30 minutes in and then actually realizing oh my gosh like my suboccipital muscles right at the base of my skull like haven't relaxed yet right. and then feeling them actually let go and it's like oh my god like those are probably working over time on a daily basis yes. and for the first time in years like they've actually been able to fully relax you don't realize, it, you you don't realize it yeah. yeah you don't realize it at all and so I think it's a it's an amazing you know especially I really it's amazing for anybody period you know that's out there because of uh, just from the standpoint of relaxing the nervous system getting magnesium right I know um, Dr. Mercola was was one of the first ones to actually talk about that you can get almost two to three months worth of magnesium from just literally floating in a float right. tank um, just with the amount that's absorbed through the skin and magnesium is something that every single day we become deficient in because we're using it for every cellular process that's out there. Um, so, I mean, just just from an overall kind of, uh, you know, it's probably one of the best ways on the planet to biohack your nervous system right. and bring it down to a balanced state. So, right. yeah, I think that's amazing. And um, also, too, I think what's other really, really cool about uh, y'all's place is that um, there's two different type of people. So when I went in there, like, I can kind of turn off my mind. I do a pretty good job of it. So, like, I was laying in there. It was, like, the best thing I've ever done. You know, I came out and Dr. Beckham makes fun of me because I was like calling her I'm like oh my gosh look at the color of the trees look at look how green everything is look how blue the sky 
is, but, you know, because there's no sensory input. But then for her, her first time doing it, it actually really took practice and focus mm -hmm. because to be able to just kind of like turn off your mind, right. it's not as easy for everybody, right. but it's even more important for people like exactly. that. Exactly, exactly. Right? That's true. And, and, it, and we're really not trying to, to turn it off completely. Right. We're just trying to calm it down yeah. and to get that chatter that keeps us so distracted and, yeah. and is so um, exhausting. Uh, yeah. you know, it, try, it just helps kind of you know, chill that out so that you're able to process what yeah. you need to process. Right. Right. And it, it does get easier and easier the more that you do it. I mean, like you said, there are two different yeah. things. Some people come out and they're just like, and, and also too, some people go in and they, they are able to create things while they're in there. Yeah. So I've gone in and I've written entire presentations just from like, yeah. I have a little audio thing that I can use inside the tank. Oh, it's a good idea. Record things yeah, while yeah. I'm floating. Yeah. And um, so you're able to, to create while you're in there as well. Um, you know, but then other times, um, you know, I just go in there and I kind of zonk out. Yeah. Um, but, but the more that you do it, the easier it gets to, um, to, to calm your mind. All you're doing is you're training your brain mm -hmm. to go from a state of stress to a state of calm. And yeah. so the more often that you do it, just like yoga, just like meditation, sure. this is very much like, you know, it's meditation on, on training wheels. Right, yeah. And so, you know, the more that you do it, the easier it becomes. The deeper you go into that relaxed state yeah and the more benefits you see yeah it. man I, I completely agree it's it's so it, it was such a, a, a moving experience that when I when I came out like I literally felt I mean I felt the effects for probably I don't know probably two or three days mm -hmm. afterwards where you just felt relaxed you felt calm you felt uh, able to really do uh, you know what you need to do as far as like just um, you know going to work going to all these different places but being able to handle the stress that's around you right, right. And I think that's pretty amazing. So I know we got to go on a quick break, um, you know, but when we get back, we're going to dive a little bit deeper into uh, sensory deprivation tank, some of the best ways to kind of biohack your nervous system. Um, but before we do, I want you to make sure because we have listeners that kind of come and go. So mm -hmm. I want you to be able to give out your information uh, and kind of what it looks like to get to, you know, contact you guys. Certainly. So. Well, we do have a discount code for this. And so, Perfect. Yeah. So yeah. Um, if, you, if you type in uh, WGOW in the um, code, the discount code section. Awesome. You'll get ten percent off. Um, Sweet. Just listen to the show today. W G O W. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Nice. And then, um, and so uh, also too. So it's um, luciditychattanooga.com is okay. our website. Yeah. Um, also, our you can call four two three nine zero three. Four one three eight, and uh, and and book an appointment that way. Yeah. Um, and we're downtown in the South Side uh, yes, area. Yes, yeah, yes, yes. Block off a of main. That's perfect. Yeah. So if they go on the website luciditychattanooga.com um, and they type in W G O W, they get a discount, That's right? right. Yep. Oh man, it's fantastic, guys! You got to do this. I'm telling you, like literally, if you have neck pain, you have back pain, maybe you have just like again, maybe the stresses of life are really you know bringing you down. Maybe you're like freaking out and worried about you know the coronavirus or whatever you got going on out there like literally one of the best ways to mitigate your stress you know is to do a sensory deprivation tank and go do a float downtown I mean they're amazing there they're gonna help take care of you uh, you know if you're a little nervous about it they're gonna walk you through it. they're gonna teach you it's actually like you get like your own little private room it's super nice like you don't feel uh, you feel very very comfortable honestly it's like a spa like feel um, and it's just an amazing experience it, you guys got to go check Check it out, luciditychattanooga.com, W-G-O-W, use that code, gets you a discount, uh, and it's going to be an amazing time. you got to go check it out. So we got to go on a quick break. Uh, when we get back, we'll talk a little bit more about it. Uh, again, guys, this is Wellness Radio. We'll see you right after the break. All right, so we get to do double duty here. So yeah, <laughs> so on here we get we are Facebook Live, and then we get on here and do the radio. Ah, but so it takes a little uh, getting used to. But guys, this is the cool thing about sensory deprivation tank that I love so much is I, t I touched on it a little bit is the magnesium that you get inside of the skin. Magnesium is a ama it's amazing at how well it absorbs through the skin. And actually, some people say the absorption through the skin gets into your cell much. Quicker quicker than actually taking it orally, which is kind of a cool thing. And when you're doing a sensory deprivation tank, you talked about it's like uh, almost a thousand pounds right. uh, of salts that are in there, magnesium salts. And so you're talking about just even within the first 15 to 20 minutes, you're starting to get major absorption into the skin. And so one of my favorite things about magnesium is the, its effect on the heart, right? Mm -hmm. And so balancing out the nervous system with that, um, you know, sometimes I'll have patients that come into the clinic that have 
have things like AFib, right? And, and these doctors are putting them on all different types of medication. We run a couple tests and find out it's a simple magnesium deficiency, right? right? Um, but what are some of the other things that you found, like uh, maybe people that come in to do the float tank that it's helped with the most? I know you mentioned ADD, mm -hmm. um, but I think a lot of people want to hear about that. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Well, for me, it was ADD because mm -hmm. I couldn't get the little monkey in my brain to stop yeah. you know, chatting away. And so in the tank, um, it, it basically just uh, pulls all of that stuff away. So you're able to just calm down. Yeah. I mean, it's it's kind of hard to explain, but your mind will do some real jumping jacks at first, but after about 15 minutes or so, you'll just notice you're just thinking about something super random. You yeah, know? Oh, yeah. Like, I, I did that. Like you're like, like you're like, man, why right now? Why am I thinking about like th something I should have done like two days ago at the office? Right. And then you kind of bring it back yeah. to the check again. You're like, oh, it's nice. I don't have to cut the grass in January. Yeah, right, right, right. yeah, exactly. So something random. Um, yeah. yeah, but um, but really, it, it it helps with all kinds of different things. I think the the best time to float for me is whenever I feel like I can't take anything else on yeah. my you know when, there's nothing else I can put on my plate yeah. when that sense of overwhelm hits you that's the best time to go in because yeah. that will it, it will pull you out of that yeah. and it will help you calm down and see things in perspective yeah. so that you'll know what is really and truly important what am I just freaking out over unnecessarily yeah, yeah, yeah. and so and what about what about for those that like are a little nervous about laying in water you know just being in like a tank like that you know kind of a what what kind of options do you have for people like that? that so we do nervous? have an open room as okay. well. Yeah. So yeah, we have we have the tanks which are in enclosed space. I mean they are huge. They're yeah, really oh, yeah. Big. yeah. They're eight foot long, four and a half foot wide, and three and a half feet tall. It's enough um, that you don't even like you know I don't even think the whole time I really felt myself yeah. touch you know yeah. any side. I mean you so. feel like you're in outer space. Yeah, you feel like yeah. you're in an enclosed yeah. space. <laughs> it's such a cool <laughs> feeling. You guys have if you've never done a sensory deprivation tank, you got to do it. It's amazing. Yeah. And then and then we also have an open pool too. So for those of you who are um, claustrophobic or have yeah. if you have mobility issues um, then the open room is a great option as well cool. and so um, and also too really what it boils down to is do you tend to get hot easily or do you tend to get cold easily people gotcha. who tend to get hot easily love the open room people who tend to get cold easily love the tanks gotcha. it's a humidity yeah. level more than anything else oh that makes complete that makes a lot of sense so like for me I like staying warm and hot so I like the closed room dr. Becca maybe a little bit maybe a little <laughs> bit different all right let's see All right, guys, welcome back to Wellness Radio. I'm your health expert, Dr. Nathan Warren. I'm actually here, um, we're talking about lucidity, Chattanooga. If you guys have never been to lucidity,